As you look down at the corner of 10th and S, you'll spot something that's been preserved for more than 80 years. Old Ironsides has been here since 1934. Archived in Sacramento's history and inside, a tribute to a post-prohibition era. Being the first bar in Sacramento, I can remember my grandparents telling me that they used to open up at six in the morning and before they opened, there was a line outside for people to get in at six in the morning. Decades full of stories. I grew up playing here. I grew up coming to shows here. This is where Sam Canellis got his start. I washed dishes when there were no automatic dishwashers. I was like, I think 12, 14 years old. This place has always been a family business. He now runs it with his retired parents never too far away. My father has been retired, but he comes in every day, sits in a corner, stool over there and kind of overlooks everything and, you know, has a quick lunch and takes off. My mother is up in our office and she still keeps active with the numbers. Sam sees retirement out of old Ironsides. I have a plan. I have things that I want to do, places I want to go. Um, I'm looking forward to it. Altogether, the family decided it's time to say goodbye and put the business up for sale. It's an emotional climb you have to take because we've been doing it for so long, but you know, it, it's time. It's something regulars can't believe. Well, it's going to be different. It's going to be strange. This place is more than just Sacramento's history. It's part of theirs too. It's like a family. No, I know all the bartenders, a lot of the regulars. Um, yeah, it's just a you always feel at home. It's my favorite bar in Sacramento for sure. While so much has changed over the years, even the music, this icon, no matter what it will be in the future, will always be to them, Old Ironsides.